time for another Ask Missy. I asked you guys to ask me questions on Twitter and I got a ton, so let's get started. First question comes from Becca. She says, I know you said your parents were house hunting. Have they found a house yet? They actually are still house hunting and it's funny because there's so many different ways nowadays for you to buy and sell houses. They actually found this really cool website called fizzber.com where you can sell and buy houses online and keep the commission even. That's been a big help on their house hunting journey. I'll actually put a link in the description so you guys can check out Fizzberg too. They are still looking for a new house and I'm really excited for them to find it and find a house that they're really comfortable in. Okay, next question is from Cydrina. She asks, do you have as many worries for your next pregnancy even after you have the surgery? After I have the surgery, I feel like I'm gonna feel really just a lot more confident in my next pregnancy and I'm not gonna have as many worries. Obviously, there's still gonna be those a little bit of worry because with any mother who's lost a child or had a miscarriage in any way, you're just gonna worry. But in the end, I feel like this next pregnancy I'm gonna be really excited about. Okay, next question comes from Danielle Harper. She says, Missy, if you could be any Disney princess, which one would you be and why? I think I would be Belle from Beauty and the Beast. I feel like I relate to her so much. She's just like, really quirky and cute, loves to read, and she falls in love with this guy who you don't think he's this um, this amazing guy until you actually get to know him, and I don't know, I just feel like I relate to her a lot. The next one is from Emily. She says, what makes you most nervous about your upcoming surgery? I think the main thing that I worry about is obviously having to have a second surgery, but I feel like with all my research that I've done, and I feel like, with what made me come to my decision in the first place with choosing the doctor that I have gone with. I don't think I have much to worry about and I'm really just actually looking forward to getting it over with. Oh, hi, Ollie. Oh, hi. Someone here? All right, next question comes from Min Too. Just curious, I know you love animals. Why aren't you a vegetarian? You are right, I love animals. I love cute, fluffy, furry, precious little animals. I love them all, big, small, little, but the truth is, I also love really juicy, bloody steak. The next question is from Jessica. What is your favorite cartoon to watch with Ollie, and which one is getting annoying? I love watching Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. I feel like it's just fun, cute. I love all the characters because we're really into Disney right now. I love the songs. But honestly, the one that I'm getting really annoyed with and done with is Frozen. I don't know why. I just am so tired of the songs and I'm tired of putting it on. And he doesn't even really care that much about it, but I'm always like, oh, let's put on Frozen. But now I'm kind of over it. Next is from Lucy. She says, if you ever had twins, would you dress them the same? Heck yes, I would. I would put them in the exact same clothes, shoes. They'd have the same haircuts. They would do all the same things, all the same activities. Yes, of course. Jackie, she asked, what do you and Brian plan on doing with the empty space upstairs in your house? As you guys know, we do have two extra bedrooms that we don't really use at the moment, but we plan on using them very, very soon. Um, I wanna turn one into a guest room, so hopefully we can have lots of friends over and people over, and we're really excited about that. And the second one we are planning on turning into a small studio, kind of a spot so that I can do videos, maybe Brian can do some videos in there, and also just store all of our video stuff. What do you guys actually think of me doing videos in a studio type setting instead of in random places like, for instance, the stairs? <laughs> okay. Oh, that was a really long burp. It like kept coming. Next question is from Ivana. She says, what is your favorite junk food except cookie dough? That is a hard one because I'm obsessed with cookie dough. Can I choose the cooked version of cookie dough because it would definitely be cookies. I love cookies more than anything. They're literally like my guilty pleasure and I'm not even that guilty about it. All right guys, that's all the questions I have for you guys today. But let me know in the comments, what is that one cartoon that you are getting so annoyed with putting on for your child? Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. So today I'm going to be talking about how I decided which doctor to choose when it came to my surgery that's coming up. Basically I will be having my septum removed from my uterus. I will be having a procedure done called the septum resection. If you don't know about my surgery and why do I need a surgery and what surgery am I getting done, I'm going to have a link down below that you can check.